Hi Mustangs, and welcome to another Counselor Thursday. Let's start off with our t -t 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 tip of the week. Please <sighs> consider the following. Hey Mustangs, it's Miss Coons with your tip of the week. This week at Westlake, we are focusing on kindness, so please find ways to show kindness to other students. Thanks. Thanks, Ms. Coons, for that tip of the week. Like she said, for the next couple of days, Westlake is going to be focusing on being kind. Let's hear from some of you and your experiences with kindness. Um, someone showed kindness to me. Um, they helped me out my homework when I didn't understand it. Somebody showed kindness to me once when I tried to open my locker, but I couldn't. They opened it for me. Somebody showed kindness for me when uh, I was walking around the school and I didn't know where I was going and then they helped me go somewhere. So someone showed kindness to me when they helped me find my locker. Someone showed me kindness helping me open my locker. Somebody showed kindness to me when I, wa when I didn't get what was going on in a certain class and they helped me um, figure something out. Someone showed kindness to me when I was nervous for a test and they supported me and gave me courage. Um, someone showed me kindness when they, I couldn't open my locker. When someone showed me kindness, it made my day because I don't have really much kindness in my life. Oh, uh, when someone showed me kindness, it was when I was at the store and I didn't have that much money to buy some, uh, something and someone from the line uh, told me that she could pay for me. When someone showed me kindness, it was maybe third grade and my friend uh, came up to me when I was uh, upset and she decided to talk to me about my day. Um, and she gave me a hug and I was really happy about that and uh, we started uh, and we're still hanging out today. An experience when someone showed me kindness was I wasn't in the best situation with where I was living because my parents had to move due to work reasons and my best friend's parents took me in and I've currently been living with her, hi Emily, <laughs> for the past two months and now we're doing a play and I'm so happy that I can call them family and I am so happy that I can still call her my best friend. When somebody showed me kindness is when I dropped my stuff last year. Um, this teacher called Miss Longstaff, helped me grab it and told me that I looked nice. An experience that I had when somebody showed me kindness was when I, like a week into school, seventh grade, um, a friend named John C. He was in my second period. I dropped my stuff. It was on my way to second period. I dropped my stuff, and all my papers fell out. And he helped me pick them up. My best friend was kind to me when I needed someone, and she was there for me. My friend was kind to me when I uh, dropped my stuff. He helped me pick it up. Somebody showed kindness to me when they let me sit with them at lunch. Okay, somebody showed kindness to me when I didn't understand a problem in math class and they helped me, so yeah. Um, somebody showed kindness to me around my first week of school. I was kind of lost wandering around in the hallways and they showed me my ways around to my classes. Um, one time I was having a bad day so my mom took me out to get food. Let's turn to Ms. Britch for a Kindness Week announcement. Okay, so starting tomorrow, we're going to have a giant poster in the lunchroom that's going to say, hashtag be kind, because we are doing Kindness Day. And so what we want from you guys is to go and pledge your kindness that it matters to you in the lunchroom. We want you to sign the poster, stand in front of it and take a picture and post it on social media. Once you post it, be sure to show your Mustang Room teacher so you can get 100 crazy points. Thanks Mustangs for tuning in to Counselor Thursday. We'll catch you next time.